All right, picture this. Quantum physics, a world where particles can be in multiple states at the same time. But here's the big question. What makes them choose one state over another? This is called wave function collapse. And, um, Sir Roger Penrose, a physicist, you know, came up with this bold idea tying it to something hardcore, consciousness. Yep, as in your mind, my mind, like collective consciousness. So Penrose proposes that wave function collapse isn't just random. Instead, it's linked to the geometry of space-time itself. Yeah, space-time. And consciousness, um, could be the trigger for this. He teamed up with anesthesiologist Stuart Hameroff and developed the ORCH OR theory. It suggests microtubules in uh, brain cells might use quantum processes to, like, create what we call consciousness. Wild, right? Critics say it's borderline sci-fi, but others think we might be missing something big. So, is reality shaped by particles? Or by minds? Stick with Hyperfocus for more on bold questions, cutting-edge physics, and science that bends reality. Subscribe to explore more.